Hey guys, how's it going? In this video, I'm going to show you how to get more out of your modded Nintendo Switch, any model. So the first thing you want to do is turn off your console and boot into Hecate. Next, go ahead and press the Tools button, then select Partition SD. All right, at this point, you should know we're going to partition the SD card. My advice? Make a backup of everything on your micro SD to your PC, or just use a brand new card. Now we're going to choose how much space you want to use for Linux, right there under the Linux EXT4 section. Then hit next step, then start, and just wait for the process to complete. Press OK, and now we're going to connect the Nintendo Switch to the PC to copy over the installation files. Go ahead and select USB tools, then SD card, and plug your Switch into your PC. Pretty simple. Now we're going to copy the Linux installation files. All you got to do is drag the files I left you to the root of your micro SD, and then just wait for the files to copy. Oh, and something important I forgot to mention. When you're creating the Linux partition, Make sure to leave at least 15 GB of free space on your micro SD so you have enough room to copy the Linux files. Now I'm going to speed up the footage of the copy since it takes a bit. We're talking about like 12 GB of data. Now go ahead and disconnect the micro SD from your PC. Back on your Nintendo Switch, go to the Partition SD button again, and this time select Flash Linux. Then hit Continue, and once again, just wait for the process to finish. When the process is done, a window will pop up asking if you want to delete the installation files. Go ahead and press that to free up the space. And that's it. Linux is ready to run. Press close, then home, go to more config, and select the Linux option. Something I want to share with you. This Linux already comes set up with almost all the compatible emulators ready to run, so you don't have to worry about finding and installing them yourself. Some apps might ask you for a privileged password. The default password is 1234. Alright guys, that's it for today. 
Now you're all set to enjoy Linux on your Switch with all your favorite emulators ready to go. If you found this helpful, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and smash the like. I've got plenty more tips and tricks coming your way, so stay tuned.